So here we have a typical five piece drum kit, which I will uh, go over the pieces with you, but this is kind of what it looks like from the front. So you'll see the hi-hat to the far right. Um, the next symbol is the crash symbol. In front here, this big drum is the bass drum. Then we have our rack toms um, on top of the bass drum. Sometimes they are attached to the cymbal stand, but in this case, mine are attached actually uh, to the bass drum. Over here, we have our ride cymbal. It's quite a bit larger than the crash cymbal, but that is our ride cymbal. And then we have over here, uh, our snare drum, as you can see, it's mine is pretty worn in. I uh, play quite a bit, so mine's pretty worn, but that's our snare drum. And then over here, uh, we have our floor tom, which is a pretty big, um, mine's, they come in different sizes. Mine is fairly large um, and it makes a deep, uh, deep drumming sound. So then we have our throne, which is the seat that we sit on when we're playing the drums. We also have our kick pedal or our bass drum pedal. And then here on our hi-hat on this particular, this is the pedal that controls the hi-hat. Um, how, uh, how much space is in between will determine how loud it is and you do that with uh, this pedal here. So from this angle we see we have again our snare drum here. We have our two uh, rack toms or tom toms. We have our floor tom here. If you can see mine sits on the floor there, floor tom. Then we have our bass drum. We have our hi-hat cymbal. We have our crash cymbal. And then we have our ride cymbal. Uh, so those are, are your basic uh, pieces to the drum kit. On the snare drum, the reason that it is called the snare drum is on the bottom, you can see that there are these little snares and that's what creates the sound.